Good afternoon, my dear colleagues. Uh, yes, uh, my name is Leonid Gusev. I represent Moscow State Institute of International Relations, where I wo have been working for 21 years after graduating from it. Yes, and uh, for these years I deal with situation in post-Soviet countries and also relations uh, between Islamic Republic of Iran and uh, Russian Federation and also internal problems of uh, Iran. And uh, I uh, decided to make my presentation about uh, nuclear problem of Iran and why does Iran need nuclear problem. But first of all, I, uh, I would like to congratulate you on Christmas and uh, New Year. Yes. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Uh, yes. Uh, uh, what uh, do we know about Iranian nuclear problem? Uh, this uh, nuclear program and Problem, yes, program and problem, yes, uh, has a, a, rather long a rather long story. It began in 70s, during even Shah's uh, regime. Uh, at that time, uh, Iran uh, had uh, big uh, plans for creating nuclear energy reactors of heavy water, and uh, such reactors of heavy waters were built. Uh, at that time, the United States were not against it, because uh, at that time, uh, the United States and Western countries were uh, close uh, allies of uh, Islamic Republic, or not Islamic, but uh, Shah Iran, uh, yes, and uh, they cooperated in many spheres and in, and, and in this sphere too. Uh, and uh, during last two years of Shah regime, Iran paid two million dollars uh, to the United States for uranium uh, and uh, the um, nuclear atomic station uh, that uh, is situation in Boucher in the southern part of Iran uh, was uh, began uh, to build with the help of a specialist from Federal Republic of Germany. I think you know that Germany at the time was divided into countries. One of them was Federal Republic of Germany uh, to Western Bloc, and the other was uh, German Democratic Republic to Soviet, uh, to, uh, belong, uh, belong to Soviet Bloc. Yes, and uh, of course, uh, 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 being uh, allies of, uh, ally of uh, Western countries, uh, that's why uh, the specialists from Federal, federal uh, Republic of Germany uh, began to build such uh, nuclear uh, atomic station, yes. Uh, but uh, after the Islamic revolution that took uh, pa that uh, took part in uh, 1999, um, um, uh, new uh, Islamic government refused creating uh, uh, creating uh, nuclear problem because uh, uh, former uh, leader of Iran, Ayatollah Khamenei, said uh, that uh, nuclear uh, uh, nuclear weapon and nuclear program is uh, a deal of uh, of, of devil. Uh, but uh, uh, in two years. In, at the beginning of 90s, uh, new uh, leader of uh, Iran, uh, Ayatollah Khamenei, and his government began to renew this nuclear program. Program, pro, uh, program why? Uh, because uh, uh, we know that in 90s there was a, uh, uh, a bloody war between Iraq and Iran, and more than one million people were killed uh, from both sides. Uh, and uh, also uh, uh, regime of Saddam Hussein used uh, chemical weapons uh, against uh, Iran. And uh, I was in Iran many times. And I saw uh, monuments uh, to this uh, 
uh, soldiers and people who were killed during uh, this war and during these chemical attacks. And also I, wore, uh, I, I saw the disabled people who were injured uh, during these uh, uh, chemical attacks. It's, it's rather uh, difficult to see at these people. Yes, and after um, uh, war uh, ended at the beginning, at, at the end of 90s, uh, the situation changed and uh, Iranian government began to renew, as I've said, uh, this uh, nuclear pro pro uh, program. But all the time um, they began to um, said that this program is peaceful. Uh, yes, uh, uh, and um, uh, many uh, specialists, say, uh, and why? Uh, after this program was renewed, many specialists uh, said, why does Iran want to use this nuclear uh, potential for uh, its country? Because we all know that Iran has a huge amount of oil and gas. Uh, that uh, Iranian oil is rather good uh, and uh, many countries uh, before sanctions of course uh, bought Iranian oil uh, among them uh, Western European countries now such countries as uh, China and India uh, are buying uh, such oil and uh, country countries of um, uh, uh, some other Asians uh, yes, uh, but um, Iranian uh, representative said uh, that um, uh, respond to that uh, that uh, these amounts of oil and gas are limited, and they uh, this amount of oil and gas belong to the future generation of the country. Also, they said uh, about uh, about. Uh, uh, problem of ecology, uh, because if you begin to take uh, from uh, Earth uh, a, lo uh, a lot of uh, oil, a lot of gas, uh, this uh, situa situation in this, uh, uh, in this place uh, is becoming uh, worse and worse. Yes, and also they uh, tell uh, that uh, um, uh, nuclear uh, uh, that nuclear program uh, is uh, uh, rather good uh, for what? Uh, for uh, science and technology, because this uh, kind of science and technology are very progressive and contemporary. Uh, and also they insist that uh, uh, their program is uh, uh, for peaceful aims only. Uh, only for peaceful aims. Uh, uh, also, you know, I think that uh, Russian um, side helped Iran uh, to build one nuclear block uh, of atomic station in Boucher because as at the beginning of my presentation, uh, I said that uh, this uh, Boucher was uh, began to build by specialists from Germany, from Federal Republic of Germany, but after revolution, they, uh, this uh, uh, station was closed, and they, uh, it, it was renewed uh, at the uh, end of the 90s of the last century with the help of Russian specialists. And uh, uh, not long ago, I think a year ago, this uh, first atomic block was built, and the uh, uh, atomic station uh, in Boucher began to work. Uh, also, uh, Russia has uh, uh, other uh, programs of uh, cooperating with Islamic Republic of Iran in building new blocks of uh, nuclear stations, but uh, maybe it will uh, happen not now, but maybe in five or ten years. And also, we know that um, international society uh, most uh, mostly Western part of international society, uh, among when the United States, Great Britain, and other uh, Western countries, uh, they uh, didn't believe that Iran uh, has only peaceful nuclear pro uh, program, and they said that Iran want uh, uh, that Iran want to create a nuclear bomb, uh, and uh, many times Iran. 
uh, also gave uh, uh, opportunity to think that he, it did this way because uh, um, atomic international atomic Ag agency wanted to uh, say uh, to, uh, to wanted uh, uh, to to put their representative to Iran to look what is being done in this nuclear station and at this nuclear plants, but Iran many times refused to eat it, saying that it is its for its national security can be. Uh, it, it, it is uh, belong to its national security. But uh, uh, not long ago, uh, we know that where was, new, uh, where was presidential elections in June of this year, and uh, uh, Iranian people elected new uh, president, uh, Mr. Rouhani. Yes, and this, uh, this new Iranian president, uh, uh, not leader, because uh, Iran is a very, very interesting country because it has Islamic leader, uh, Rahbar in Persian language, uh, who is Ayatollah Khamenei. But president Ed is the second uh, man in the Iranian hierarchy. It, uh, can be um, at it, it uh, like a prime minister maybe well, we know in many countries uh, very like in Russia for example there is a president and there is a prime minister in in, in Iran <laughs> the situation also is very interesting uh, the supreme leader and after that the president and the president uh, works as a prime minister maybe the second uh, uh, part uh, in, uh, in in the country but uh, he also has a have a big power. Yes, and after electing new president, uh, who is more liberal than uh, Ahmadinejad, who was before the uh, Rouhani, uh, he began uh, to new talks uh, with Western and uh, country, uh, Western countries and also Russia, and they agree not long ago that uh, Iran um, will uh, eliminate all his uranium uh, and uh, his uranium will be uh, enriched only to five percent uh, yes and after that uh, the sanction against this country will be uh, taken uh, away taken off da? yes and uh, it will be done be, uh, within uh, six months uh, it was happened uh, approximately a month ago. All uh, countries uh, agreed this. Uh, 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 agreed this, uh, uh, and uh, uh, now we will see. Maybe at uh, the beginning of, uh, I think, June, uh, of June, what really happened or not with these talks uh, between Western countries and Iran. And, uh, uh, and at the end of my speech, I can say that, uh, oh, yes, this uh, uh, problem, Iranian nuclear uh, program, is uh, rather difficult. Uh, and I think we all uh, should uh, hope that it will be decided and uh, it will come to a peaceful situation in uh, Middle uh, East and all uh, the region and all uh, neighboring countries of uh, Iran, because for Russia it's also very um, needed. It's, it's needed for Russia because uh, on the doesn't border on Iran uh, by Earth, but the borders on uh, on uh, Caspian Sea. Yes, and uh, also uh, such uh, our uh, allies in Caucasus and in uh, Central Asia also borders, uh, border on uh, Iran. And uh, if something uh, happens in 
Iran, it will influence the situation in these uh, countries uh, uh, which border on uh, Iran. Well, that's why its uh, uh, situation is very uh, uh, useful and uh, very, uh, it's uh, very important for uh, Russian Federation. Yes, thank you very much. Uh, uh, yes, uh, for listening to me.